I think there's probably a good point to sneak in the value pyramid discussion again. We've talked about it a little bit, but maybe just help again uh, us understand because this is exactly tied to Yeah, that. so as a business moves out of sort of that owner and people driven level into a systems driven uh, company, the systems take on uh, ownership in a way for, for some aspect of the business. Right. You have, a, diff you have a, a person that leaves, you have a hiring system that hopefully goes out and finds a new person. You have an orientation system that hopefully trains that person into their job. You have systems for the actual jobs that show them how they need to do different aspects of their business. And it's a bit of a scale. I mean, I recognize that, that uh, you know, a, let's say a McDonald's, for example, the buzzer goes off when it's time for the french fries to come up. That's, that's a system, that's a tight system. And so as we look at the different parts of a business, we have to sort of have tighter systems for some parts of a business and perhaps you know, looser systems for other parts. But definitely we need systems because systems are what give us uh, confidence and certainty in, in moving forward with the business. Wait, business owners allow their businesses to grow but often want to keep uh, control, like reins on all the horses. They want to hold on to all the reins uh, for all the aspects of their business. But at some point, uh, the business runs into kind of a glass ceiling around that. There's a barrier. You can only go so far by having a business that's run entirely just by an owner or even by people. And there's always going to be inherent risk in that. And I, I think it's important also to recognize, even at the, the front end of this uh, episode, that systems, sometimes people think of them as restricting, you know, I gotta follow these rules. They're freeing. And I mean, here's the best example I can give you. I remember working with a, a client who for years had never been able to take vacation away from the business for more than, you know, maybe a day, and that was pushing it. And uh, he took his family for not a week, but two weeks, three weeks. It was uh, almost a month gone away from the company. And the company ran. That's, it was phenomenal. That's fantastic. Right.